The good news? I had a blast sightseeing around the Big Apple. New York City is one of my favorite destinations. In this road trip, I made sure to check out some of New York's best spots. I hit Times Square, Radio City Music Hall, Rockefeller Center, Lower Manhattan, and most importantly, the National September 11th Memorial. I guess you could say that I had the New York state of mind most of the weekend. Game day started off great too, because before the game, I met paths with diehard Packers fan Tony Leonard from Houston, Texas. Leonard was decked out in green and gold. Loved that white fur coat too. Now I was excited to photograph the game Sunday night at MetLife Stadium in New Jersey. I mean, any time you have two great teams on a national stage, you know it's going to be good. Boy, was I wrong. The game stunk. A touchdown and one field goal were my only offensive opportunities. That's it. No big plays, no diving catches. The Packers stunk it up out there. In a game like this, which is an old-fashioned butt whooping, you need images that say losing or defeated. My best storytelling image was a Packers quarterback, Aaron Rodgers, as he took a hard hit by a Giants defender. His facial expression says it all. I also had a handful of images that showed A-Rod's body language, which I think summed up the game best. Here are some of my other favorite images that I shot from along the lines of MetLife Stadium in New Jersey. Last season, the Packers took an early exit in the playoffs thanks to the Giants. This season, they handed it to the Packers again. Let's hope the third time is the charm because I wouldn't mind taking my sightseeing opportunities down to the Big Easy.